Hi, Taisei. Hi, Jeannie. Tell us a bit more about how this movement has come together. Yes, as you said, this uh, Yellow Vest movement was a movement that was created f uh, to protest against rising fuel taxes. And it started with dozens of petitions online against those taxes on, that were created in the summer, uh, including one that was launched in May and published on social media in September, and that now has more than 990,000 signatures, and it's still counting. Um, but this it's actually on Facebook that the movement has uh, started getting traction. Um, a video was published back in October in the 18th um, by a woman called Jacqueline Moreau. I'm sorry, I mispronounced that completely. Already has Her video already has more than 6 million views. And it resonated with a lot of people because uh, of her plain language. She is very angry at Emmanuel Macron as well. And it's a simple four-minute video that was filmed uh, as a selfie, a uh, selfie camera. And at the end, she she denounces a sort of witch hunt against French drivers and asks where, like, when will it end? So she asks other people to film themselves, post it, post it on social media, which many people have done. And other people have also uh, taken photos of themselves wearing their yellow vests and uh, created songs in support of the movement. They have created memes that are quite funny, some of them, um, and changed their profile picture to show support. So we, we see that it's... Um, very widespread all over France. There are dozens, if not hundreds, of Facebook pages, events, and uh, groups that were created uh, calling on people to take to the streets, block the streets. And um, there was an attempt to centralize these efforts using Google Maps to show the places where the protests were taking place. Now, as is often the case on social media, there have also been more and more controversial comments in these posts. Yeah, what it's important to understand in that is that this is not a movement that is uh, driven by a single organization that would um, bear the legal responsibility of a Facebook page. So it's kind of hard to moderate the comments, and there are certainly administrators to those pages, but we don't necessarily know who they are. And as we can see, the movement, as you said before, has have uh, grown to be more than just about the price of fuel and touches now on a bigger issue, which is the return that French people have for the amount of taxes that they pay. And so inevitably, the Yellow Vest do not speak with one voice, and there are normal citizens involved um, that have all sorts of complaints, either from the left or from the right. And uh, that's why it's so difficult to control what is said online and that have accountability uh, in cases of racism or whenever there are fake news being spread about the movement, and also for the government to speak to someone that speaks for the group. So now uh, we know that they have elected, selected representatives that are speaking to the government, and we'll see what happens now. All right, Taisei, thank you so much for that. That's our social media editor, Taisei Pranchi. Thank you.